Yeah, this has gotten way out of control. Way out of control. Yeah, look at that. That's crazy. Leaf of the bugs. Wow. Alright, so let me go get my soapy water. Also, in here I am seeing vine bore holes. That's a vine bore hole. So, let me get my injector and I will inject some BT. I hate to waste my morning doing this BS, but it's got to be done. Got to save the squash. All right, so I'm going to use this white planter here that's got rainwater in it from last night. Um, I'm going to add some uh, Castile soap and uh, I'm just going to snip off these um, squash leaves and blossoms that have the um, nymphs all over them. I'm just going to smother them in the water. Ugh. So there's a hole. That's a vine bore hole right there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my uh, syringe. Um, I got this one. I had my wisdom teeth taken out to irrigate the hole. I'm going to fill this syringe with the BT, uh, the Bacillus thuringiensis, and uh, we're just going to flush it out. I actually have a little bit left that's already mixed up in the spray bottle. So let me load this up and we will inject it. Oh, okay, it wants to, it wants to squirt. All right, here we go. guy will get his belly full of that BT and die. It looks like we have more damage underneath. So the foil really doesn't doesn't stop anything, which sucks. Well, let me get this foil off. Yeah. Well, it looks like the foil Oh yeah, the foil didn't really stop the pests. So pretty bad. All right, let me uh, see if I can inject some BT, but I don't know if this uh, squash can be saved, actually. We'll see. I may go ahead and start some more seeds. So just about every single one of these squash plants is absolutely ate up with vine borer. Um, I'm tempted to rip all of them out and just start over from seed. I'm oh. just real upset because I stayed on those eggs forever. And then of course I got distracted by my mom and our visit. Anyway, the, the squash bugs and the vine borer have just taken over my squash and I'm real sad. Um, I did kill quite a few of the um, squash bug nymphs and the uh, leaf footed bug nymphs. Um, but I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna trim all of the damaged foliage off and I'm gonna inspect all the stems and the ones that I think are trash, I'm just gonna trash them. I just, I'm learning that I don't have time to baby sick plants. I just don't have time. Um, yeah. All right, so I'm on the back side, and I've noticed that my Casper pumpkin is wilty, even though we had lots of rain. And you see how yellow the stems are? And we've got some vine borer entry points going on. Um, yeah. So that vine borer, hold on. See that? That's where the vine borer has entered the stem. I don't know if I can save my pumpkin. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get uh, my syringe and I'm going to
put some Bt into the stem. Um, if I can kill that maggot, the plant will survive. Um, but I've got to kill it. So I'm going to do the syringe thing again with this. I really don't want to pull it out, but I think I am going to start some more seeds. Well, the little maggot actually popped out and um, it landed on my finger and I flicked it out of reflex and I lost it in the grass. I was gonna, did I see it? I was gonna show you what the maggot looked like and I lost it, so anyway. But the maggot popped out. I don't know if that was the only one in there because there are several elbow joints where there's holes, but I'm gonna search out the rest of the holes and flush it out and see if, um, if I can heal this plant. So that's encouraging, I popped one out. Okay, so I was able to see the maggot's little head in there. He's moved. There he is. You see him? That's the vine borer maggot. Ugh. Okay, there. You see how sweaty I am? The things I do for these plants, wasn't that maggot gross? That was gross. Um, so that's what's in all of my pumpkins and my squashes is that freaking maggot. So I got to do it though. So I'm going to go get a big old swig of water. Oh yeah. My shirts are towels. Anyway, um, let me get to work on this plant. All these plants. I think this is probably going to dominate the rest of my day. So.